feel like this sense of awareness that I didn't have and thinking that like I have to wait to become this version of myself when like I'm entirely the perfect version of myself now. Oh, yeah. I am the greatest version of myself now. Oh. There's only me right now. Like this is it. It's just me. Like okay. there's yes. no but there's no greater version. Like I am the greater version. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> That's oh, <laughs> and I really forgave my dad. Oh, like for real. Yeah. He asked this question, like, how would you feel, like, if your dad were to die today? And I was like, indifferent. And then I felt guilty for feeling that way. But it's because I hadn't truly forgiven him. And then once I forgave him, and I realized that I chose him to be my dad for this reason then I felt compassion. Mm -hmm. And then I felt love. Mm -hmm. And then I'm like, I don't want him to die. He's my dad. Mm -hmm. oh. yeah. <laughs> That's to do yoga with Diana um, I I'm not a yoga person I like to do meditation but you know what this session it has really inspired me to become more in tune with my body and really explore yoga more so I'm just really inspired I'm really grateful to be in this space right now with beautiful souls and learning how to come back to my body and also appreciate my body. So thank you so much, Diana. So I bow my hand in gratitude. absolutely absolutely transformational it was healing nourishing I learned a lot from all the different healers um, and so much about plant medicine and how much it's changed my life um, I, I felt so quiet I honestly like most of the time I was like oh do I really like belong here <laughs> and um, like throughout like as the days like went on and I like I could just feel how welcoming everybody really was and um, I could feel that I was like still like holding back and I didn't really want to allow myself to you know feel part of everybody mm -hmm. um, but you know throughout the ceremonies um, especially today that's really helped me you know like feel like I belong like I finally found <laughs> my soul tribe and it's just, it was just an amazing ceremony and I'm so grateful, um, I hope. I think 
peaceful and relieving and at the same time it was just so I don't want to say enlightening but I want to say it's been a huge eye-opener <clears throat> I'm so grateful I feel a lot of gratitude for my new family and for my past family for allowing me to be here so I feel in a way it's it's a beautiful mess. Life-changing. It was like nothing I would have expected. I feel like I've released so much that I was carrying and I didn't need to carry. I got uh, so much insight on the things I needed to let go of. Mm -hmm. I just want to run home to my family. Like I have this deeper appreciation for them and I feel like me like I feel like I'm supposed to feel like like not a different person I, I don't I didn't I'm not leaving here a different person I'm leaving here me like I've never felt more myself I feel like there's been a weight that has been lifted I feel grateful for this experience it's been truly like they're there are no words to describe like how amazing this experience was. And thank you, Diana. Thank you um, for everybody who helped put this together because this was the most incredible experience of my life. Oh. It was incredible, life-changing, so beautiful, filled with love. Like I can't even put most of what happened into words, but it was literally, <sighs> So refreshing. I feel like I got so much insight on what I need to do moving forward and things that I need to change in my life. And I just, my heart, it's literally sore because it's filled with so much love. Like that's the only thing I can say. Like my heart is full of love and I'm so happy I came. I actually tried to back out of coming because I was so scared of the change. Um, like I wasn't, I felt like I wasn't ready for the change, but I was, but you know, the fear always likes to creep in. Um, so I'm so happy that I didn't. Diana actually was like, girl, you cannot back out of this. Like she was holding my ass accountable and I'm so happy she did. I'm so grateful to her for that and putting this whole thing on and bringing all of us together. I feel like everybody who came here, like I knew them in a way, like we all were so connected and it was so beautiful. <laughs> like, that's all I have to say. No words after that. It was amazing. Um, the house, the location, the food, the space that was held for us from our, our leader, Diana. She really created this space where we could just be our authentic selves and go into the weekend knowing that we're safe and protected. She's there to guide us, to lead us. Uh, everyone that came out was amazing. You really feel the love in these types of things. Um, just overall, a very nice, tranquil place to relax and really get grounded and reset, recharge those batteries. So I'm very thankful for Diana and everyone who came out. Very grateful for this life. Hey,